Hello, and this is Devin. It is currently 11 o'clock at night, and we are at South Pole Station, Antarctica, and I thought I would give everyone a tour of the facility while everybody else is in bed. So there's not so many people around, and we're looking out the front of the station. Um, what you can see is uh, one of the shuttle vehicles driving up right now, and also the firefighting equipment. Uh, which is directly in front of us, uh, that is used to cover the ski way, which is our ice runway. Um, out to the right, we can't see it very well in this video, but that is the South Pole 10 meter telescope. And we'll step inside here. First of all, you'll notice that our outside doors are actually giant freezer doors, like you'd see in any industrial freezer. Um, but in this case, instead of keeping the cold in, they are indeed keeping the cold out. And we'll walk in through the entryway here. And this is the main entryway to South Pole Station. Stairwell leading up to the upper levels. As you can see, we've got people watching movies. Actually, it looks like they're watching uh, 24 in our lounge. This is the coat room, which I will open. Anybody that does not live in the station can store their, uh, their equipment in the coat room. And we also have some displays here for the tourists. This is one of the Ice Cube Project pods. I wonder if one of these switches will turn on the lights. Indeed it will. Here we have a number of old South Pole markers. Every year we put a new marker out and move the pole as the ice shift is or the ice sheet is shifting rather. A number of other trinkets and mementos. and some pieces of South Pole history, cash stamps, letters, that sort of thing. And there's the old USAP logo. This is a fire alarm panel. Shows you the layout of the station. Anywhere there's a fire, it would light up. That's one of my jobs as a first responder, is to respond to that fire panel and determine where the fire is. Here's our gym. This is our activity room. It actually serves as a music room. Probably nobody in there right now. Quite a selection of musical equipment, amplifiers, that sort of thing. And here's our gymnasium. As you can see, fully functional. This also serves as our movie theater. Uh, that white sheet there is our screen. We have a nice high definition projector. And upstairs is the uh, the workout room and gym. I'll show you that in a bit. Take a stroll down the station hallway. Here's the comm shop where I work with Brian. And here's Brian. You can see him engaged in working at midnight. Official working at midnight business. Anyway, this is the comm shop. This is my little office here. My computer. This is the network engineer's office. And this is my boss, Henry's office.
This is one of the many cargo decks. Again, the freezer doors to keep the cold out. And even at midnight, the activity here at the station does not stop. This is the stairwell leading up to the roof. Science storage area. More stairwells leading up to the second level where we'll go later. This is the emergency power plant where uh, there are multiple gener generators to supply heat and power to the station should the main generators fail. The arts and crafts room for those creatively inclined. This is one of our comms closet, just network switches and the like. These lockers contain the firefighting equipment. Here we have a library and medical storage. I'll go in the library if indeed there's no one in here, but there is. This is the birthing areas where we'll go later. Here are our laundry facilities, free laundry soap for everyone. They all run on cold water except for one to save on energy. And these are our glycol dryers. They run off, well, electricity and waste heat from the power generators. Here is the growth chamber, which you can't see right now because the lights are out. It's nighttime in there. You can see our happy plants. My friend Craig runs that. Here is the South Pole Post Office. It's open sparingly, but it is an official U.S. Post Office. And here is our South Pole Store, which you uh, can't get into right now because it's closed. That's the stairway that leads up to the galley. We have another cargo deck. More firefighting equipment. This is our sauna where I've never actually been. Another coat room. And finally, apparently we're locked out right now, but maybe not. This is the entrance to the beer can, affectionately known as the beer can. Uh, kind of a ways down. You get down there and it's about 55 below zero. It is an unheated access to the tunnels and under snow, under ice parts of the station. And so that's the first floor of the new South Pole Station.